Hey guys, how's it going? So I just wanted to share this video with you here today of three tips that I came across. I think that if you implement these into your website, that you'll start seeing a lot more calls coming your way. So we all know that's a good thing. Let's hop into it. So right over here in Google, we can see I've pulled up Roofer Springdale AR. Now the reason for that keyword is there's a lot of traffic going that direction. In fact, actually 500 people are searching that every single month. That's a lot of people to be in front of and it's very costly you know to not be in front of those so this is going to be a video showing you how to get in front of these people in particular searching for this keyword phrase every single month right now you know you're not on this first page you're not on this map pack you're not down any any of these uh below uh you're on page like two three four five uh in the sad truth you know is nobody's going to pages two three four or five anymore it's just whoever's on the first page and if somebody scrolls through the first page they don't they don't like anything and whatever they just search something else and you better hope to god that you show up on the first page of whatever they search next so how do you get into this map pack you know why is it important well it's pretty important because as people continue to use their smartphones this is becoming a lot of where the clicks go. Um, in fact, 78% of the business is starting to go down here. So if you're not listed in here, you're leaving money on the table. That's not a good thing. And the way to get in here is through these things called citations. Now, right now, Pinnacle Roofing, you know, they've got the most. I don't know how much off the top of my head, but they have the most because they're ranked the highest. And all a citation is is simply your business's information listed in different directories across the web. And the more you have of these, the higher Google is going to rank you. So that's why they're at the top right now. Uh, next, we have your organic rankings, right? Uh, nobody cares about Home Advisor, BBB, Yelp, Angie's List, and all that. They only really care about real local businesses because people are tired, and I'm sure you guys are tired too. People are tired of getting hit up by a whole bunch of contractors when they want their roof done. Um, and I'm sure you're tired of these other companies, you know, passing your leads around uh, like you know, sharing. It's just, it's not a good situation. So what people are doing is they're just clicking on the actual sites uh, in these areas. And so it's, you know, really important to be that site that they click on. And what Pinnacle Roofing has done, you know, not only are they at the top, this map pack, they're the top spot organically. And the way to get there, you know, similar to citations, these things called backlinks. And not to get all too technical, but all a backlink really is is simply your website's link listed on another website. Uh, the important thing is, though, like you have to find good sources for these. You have to think of them like votes. The more votes you have, the better. Um, and from the more sources you have, too. Um, if we actually go check them out, we can see that they've got 255 of these votes from 51 different sources. They're ranking for 213 keywords. We've got about 109 people visiting their site every single month with a $1,300 page traffic value. You know, that, those are some good numbers. Beatable, but good numbers nonetheless. If we were to take a look over at your site, you know, you've only got 23 votes from two different sources. You're ranking for 12 keywords, but you've only got one person visiting your site every month. And for all we know, that could be me right now. Uh, and you've got a $37 page traffic value. There's some work to be done here and it can be done by increasing your backlink count um that is that's really key in pulling you up in the rankings you want to have a whole lot of other sites referring you voting for you so google will recognize you and pull you to the top accordingly uh, this last thing i want to focus on is uh these keywords and you're probably wondering okay well they're ranking for 213 i'm ranked for 12 you know what's What's the big difference? The big difference actually comes down to the amount of words you have on your site. Uh, if we go over, you know, check you out, you got a paragraph here, paragraph there, map, and contact form. It's pretty much it. Uh, there's not a whole lot of words to go off of for Google to just decide to rank you up top because you're not displaying to them that you're the knowledge leader in the industry. You see, Google wants to display the most knowledge that they can with each search results um, because that's in their best interest to rank information. Uh, furthermore, you guys only have three pages, so not only do you not have a lot of words on your page, 
but you don't have a lot of pages with information um, at all. And if we were to check out Pinnacle Roofing, you know, they've got a couple paragraphs here at the top, a couple paragraphs here at the bottom, uh, and they've got 66 different pages. So they probably have like a blog or something that they're posting every single month, uh, getting Google to come back. And after a while, all that information kind of piles up and Google is like, oh, wait, you know, these guys, they really know our, or know their stuff. I think it's going to be helpful for, uh, for the people searching, so then, you know, Google ranks them. Um, that's just kind of how that goes. Uh, and just as kind of like some social proof of that, you know, if you were to go over to Google, I've got this pulled up just to save uh, save time. But if you type in Mike Tyson, you're going to find that his Wikipedia page shows up first, not his actual website, which is listed number two. And, you know, why is, why is that the case? Well, Wikipedia has more information about Mike Tyson on their page than Mike Tyson has about Mike Tyson on his actual website. Um, and that just, you know, again, that just goes to show, um, you know, why content is so important, why Google ranks content. So those are the three tips I have for you guys. Citations for your GMB, backlinks for your website to pull it up organically, and content for your website so you can start ranking for more keywords to then start showing up in more search results search results i hope these were helpful you know i'd like to you know hop on the phone maybe talk about what questions you guys might have i'm sure i didn't cover everything or there's some questions you might have um and we can talk about those i'm totally open to that take care have a great day